This is witchcraft. <laughs> Hola mis Anabellas and welcome back to the channel. So today is August 24th. It is my 21st birthday. Um, it is 7.41 a.m. I look crazy. Yeah, I'm not dressed or ready to go out in any way. But um, today I'm going to be vlogging my day, my birthday. Um... I will not even lie to you. I'm kind of off to a bad start. I'm kind of emotional. I'm kind of sad. And I don't want to cry. But I feel like I might cry. <laughs> and this is a bad start to the vlog. But I just like... I feel like it should be bigger. You know what I mean? Like... I feel like it should be bigger. I feel like more things should be happening. I know it's only 7 a.m., but like, I've only gotten a happy birthday from my sister. And yesterday, my abuelito, he called me and he said happy birthday early to me. Um, unfortunately, I won't be able to see him today because he's in Mexico and he can't cross the border um, until like September. So I won't be able to see him today, unfortunately. But um, yeah, I'm going to try and make the most of my day. I'm going to tr make sure that my 21st birthday isn't awful. So I'm going to try to do my best today to have high spirits, high something. I don't know. But uh, welcome to the vlog. First things first. I want to like eat good today, or at least try to, um, but I'm going to start my day off with the Oreos. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. Oreos are bomb. They're not double stuff. They're just regular stuff. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Here we go. I don't know say, but like, Oreos just, they always hit the spot. Like, they know that they made a good cookie. And thank you for making this cookie. Mm. Yeah, so good. So next, um, I'm probably, what, what's going to happen is I'm going to wait for... Um, my mom to come back. She's dropping off my sister. But wait for her to come back and then she's going to get ready. She's going to leave to work. Then I'm going to go ahead and do my regular stuff. As you guys know, I work out and then I shower. And after that, I am going to go to Starbucks because I have a free drink. And today is the day. The fall menu has dropped. So I'm going to get the pumpkin cream chai tea latte. And I'm also going to get their baked apple croissant. So we're going to treat ourselves. Starbucks is half treating. I'm going to get the drink free on Starbucks. Then I'm going to pay for the croissant. But it's my day. I'm excited. Also... If you're wondering, since I am 21 now, will I drink alcohol? No, I'm not drinking alcohol today. Um, my family doesn't drink alcohol. It's not a, in our, I know, you're probably like, what? Mexicans who don't drink alcohol? Yeah. Um, not really our thing. Even in Mexico, like, my, most of my family is in Mexico, but like, they're still... There's some of us here, obviously. Um, but yeah, no. And my plan, what I really wanted to do was be at Disneyland today. And if I was at Disneyland today, t I would have gotten my first drink at Avengers Campus. But we're not there. 
So, I probably, most likely, definitely won't be having a drink of alcohol. So, sorry to anybody who was maybe thinking that would happen today. It's not, it's not. It's not. I've changed. I'm ready to work out. Um, I cried. I, I cried. Oh, there's just like so many emotions that I'm feeling right now. But I'm not going to get into it. You guys probably don't want to hear that either. Um, so I'm going to work out. I'm not going to film my workout because it's the same thing every single time. Then I'm going to shower. And then we are going to take a trip to Starbucks. And to Bonds, which is right next door. Because I want to get myself another treat or something if they even have it um and also if my drink is bad then i'll throw it out and i'll get a drink that i do like i'm pretty sure it's gonna be good though I, also the calorie count is actually ridiculous so like i don't know what i should do because <laughs> the drink is free starbucks is giving me my drink for free but like i don't want to like <laughs> It's almost like 600 calories for a venti, which is what I usually get, a venti. I mean, it's my birthday, right? <laughs> like, why not? But the, the calorie count is insane. I think I should just do it, though. I'm working out. I'm not done working out. And, uh... It's going well, I am almost done. But right now, it's 9.58. And I'm sorry for my heavy breathing. Um, but I am here getting ready for Teddy Fresh. They're Trixie Mattel, Teddy Fresh. I'm so sorry, I'm, I'm tired. Their drop is on my birthday at 10 a.m. Okay, 9.59. And if you know me, you know I love pink. And I actually do love Trixie. Like, I have barely started to get to know her. Um, but I love the Trixie Motel because I love flipping, in case you guys didn't know, and like interior design and all that stuff. <laughs> I'm one of those girlies, yes. Um, but I love that show. I'm not done with it yet, but that's how I got introduced to Trixie. And I love pink, favorite color in the world. So, I'm gonna try to grab something. I'm tired. So I will keep you guys updated <laughs> if I get anything. So I'm looking through and I don't think I actually want anything. Man, I was really excited, but the only things that actually interest me, like really, are yes, these socks, this necklace, and that's pretty much it. <sighs> oh, well. I mean, I love this dress, too. But, like, I don't think I could pull it off. You know? I don't think I could. And I like this one, too. But I feel like it's just too big. It's unisex. And the unisex is really big. Uh, I have a unisex. A hoodie for Teddy Fresh and it's massive so I'd just rather go with women's sizes and uh, it's not so yeah okay everybody so this is my outfit for today it is it's cute so it's this like new green vest cardigan that I have and then my black jeans and then my pink Air Force pink and white Air Force ones but I love it. It's so cute. I need a better setup so I can show you guys. But it's it's cute. It's really cute. I love it. So, um, yeah. And this is my hair. My hair looks really bomb. It looks really great. I'm so happy my hair turned out literally the exact way that I want it for my birthday. So, uh, it's a good day. It's a good day. Ta-da! There you go. You can kind of see. It's cute. It's cute. And then, uh, look, my arm. Can you even see it in this light? Probably not. I probably look like I have scrawny arms. 
Um, but let's head out. Let's go. So first what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Vons. And once we reach like the Vons area, that's when I'm going to place my mobile order for Starbucks. So I go into Vons, look for the stuff. And then by the time I'm out, the Starbucks is right next to Vons. So I'm just going to walk right in and get it. And uh, we'll try this stuff together. So exciting. So exciting. Let's head out. Let's head out. Let's head out. Let's head out. Okay, so I think you guys can like see. There you go. Yeah, my hair looks really good today and this is the outfit. I really like it. Um, but it's a very nice day. Today's a very beautiful day. Of course, it's my birthday. So the weather did this on purpose. But uh, it's gonna be a nice pleasant walk. secured the goods. This looks really good. I won't even lie to you. This looks pretty bomb. I am back. Finally. The walk back was definitely a little bit difficult. I got a little bit warm. I won't lie. But the weather's still nice. So we have the venti ice pumpkin chai. That's this one. And they were sold out of the baked apple croissant, which what I, which was what I was going to get. So there's a Starbucks inside the Vons as well. So I went in there and I asked them, do they have it? And they do. So we have a baked apple croissant. Yeah, baked apple croissant and my iced pumpkin chai. So this is gonna be fun. It's gonna be fall on my birthday. So can't go wrong, can't go wrong. Let's not waste any more time. So I have the croissant there, right? So let's try my drink first. Um, people, no, oh my god, <laughs> literally, I'm insane, okay, so the ice pumpkin chai, that's the best drink I've ever had in my life, I swear to god, I swear to God, I am not kidding you. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. The chai. Like the combination of this together makes a whole different drink. So what it is, it has pumpkin cream cold foam on the top or sweet foam, sweet foam. And it has pumpkin spice in there as well. And then the chai tea. Oh my god. Yo, this is literally the Starbucks. Keep this year round for me. For me. You can't like, please. Oh my god. This. This is the thing. Okay. The croissant. Okay, I don't know how to, I'm gonna pull it apart. It's probably criminal, but. <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> Are you serious right now? Where have these things been my whole life? Starbucks. Oh my God, this is so good. So how can I explain this to you? So it's a croissant. This is a croissant, but the croissant It's sweeter. So there's definitely like some 
So there's apple jelly or I don't even know what you call that. Like apple jelly, like what you would see in an apple pie. Like that kind of jelly, like um, like the apple pie from McDonald's, that jelly. Mm-hmm. But it's mostly at the top. Mm-hmm. So the apples and like the apple jelly is mostly at the top. What it is, is that the croissant itself is literally sweeter. Mm-hmm. The croissant itself is sweeter. Like there's, I don't know. This is witchcraft. Witchcraft for my birthday. Go off Starbucks, go off. This is what we need. This is what we, we've been waiting for. This good stuff, like bring it, bring your A game to the table more often. Not just during fall. Like, hello? Oh my God. The calories are so worth it. You are worth it. You are worth it. Queen. Queen. Queens. Oh my God. Let me enjoy. I'm going to enjoy this. But with what? We should watch something. Let's watch something. I vote. We watch something. Yes. I almost forgot to show you what else I got. So I got milk um, just because, like, in case I want to make drinks and stuff. And, of course, I had to get my favorite cookies for me. It's my birthday. And based on what has happened earlier and stuff, <sighs> we're not going to go to Crumble Cookie. And I already know it. And I wanted to go to Crumble Cookie because, obviously, my free birthday cookie but these are amazing, so these will do. All right, now let's, I'm, I actually have been freaking tasked. I don't mind, to be honest with you. But I've been tasked with cleaning the house again, but like cleaning, deep cleaning a little bit more. So I'm going to finish my tasks, then get back to my stuff. And then we will continue watching Never Have I Ever. Which, by the way, uh, yes, I have been binging that show. I have. I personally... <laughs> I don't even know. I think I'm like halfway through season three. And in my last vlog, you guys watched. I didn't make it too far into season one. But in the few days that I've been back, because I didn't watch anything over the weekend because I was, you know, busy with other stuff. Um, I've been watching. I'm team. What's his name? Ben, the white boy. Although technically both are white since Paxton is half white. So he's white. But the white boy, Ben. I'm team Ben. So we'll see what happens. But yeah. Okay, I'm sorry. I keep looking at myself because I'm like, wow, girl, you look good. Like, you look good. And that's good. Love yourself, people. Love yourself. So here I am. Here's what I've chosen to do. Um, my drink, my croissant. My croissant's kind of cold. My drink's kind of like room temperature now. But it's okay. We're going to continue watching Never Have I Ep Oh, I guess we're only on episode one of season three. But I've gotten pretty far. All right. There you go. There I am. This show's so crazy, by the way. It really is. Whoever said it's like miraculous, you're so right. But Mariah's on the cringe level, nothing else. Mm. This is literally the best. Mm. It's so good. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's my birthday, but like, I'm literally, I'm glowing, right? Like something's happening to me. Mm. Uh, yeah. Okay, so I finished the croissant. Guys, that was like, <laughs> so good. 
so good. Anyways, watching this show. Yeah, this white boy. I'm team that white boy. He's cool. I think. Maybe I'm getting the wrong vibes. But I feel like he's... He's good. Since I finished the croissant, I decided I'm going to get some chips. Because I'm still watching, like... So, but that's pretty much actually all I've had today. The croissant. And this drink. And it's almost one-ish. It's like 12 something, but it's almost one-ish. So that's pretty much all I've had today. So I haven't had much today. Um, but I'm waiting till later when I can go out and get something good. I wanted to eat at Toadstool Cafe today at Universal, but reservations are completely gone. So thank you to everybody who ruined my plans. Thank you. The people at Universal, obviously. How dare they? Whatever. Their food was mid anyways. Let's continue watching. You literally will not believe this. You won't believe this. You won't believe this. I just complained to the universe and... Guess what? I just got a booking for Toadstool Cafe for 5.45 p.m. Um, thank you. Thank you, world. You heard me. Now, I'm not sure if I'm even going to be able to make it. But. Hopefully we will. But if not, we still have like Universal in general to just go to. And that's what I want to do. So. 545 it looks like we might be going so yay all right everybody finished my chai that was so good i mean you guys saw my reaction but oh my god that was so good um now i'm on to episode three for season three um after that i'm gonna take a break and like uh go on youtube and uh Respond to comments, like comments, um, Instagram, everybody who's saying happy birthday, thank them. And of course, any uh, fan edits, which I've seen already a few. Thank you so much. You guys are amazing, absolutely talented, stunning, amazing, one of a kind, brilliant. You know how it goes. Um, Yeah, so we're going to do that. And... Yeah, it's going to be pretty chill until we finally go to Universal Studios. So, so excited for that. I'm so excited. Wow, this show is just something else. Muchachas y muchachos y grogu. So, my mom is getting out of work soon. And she asked me, do I want Starbucks? You think I'm going to say No. So, I'm going to get the same drink, but in a tall. Starbucks, you have created a monster. I mean, I was already a Starbucks monster before today, but that drink is a whole nother level. Like, you don't understand how good it is. Like... I will riot if it's not brought back every single fall. Okay, Starbucks? You better be watching. You better. Why would you be watching this? I don't know. But don't do this. Don't take it away from me. Anyways, we're going to get that. And uh, if she wants to get the croissant, I wouldn't mind getting another croissant. Because it was fire, dude. <laughs> it's so good. Oh. Starbucks, what have you done to me? Yo soy mexicana, okay? Yo soy latina. But sometimes I do be acting like a gringa, okay? What can I say? Well, I love Starbucks. Y no es mi culpa, okay? No tengo vergüenza, nada de eso, pero... I love it, okay? So... <laughs> Starbucks you've created a monster you've created a monster so everybody we're back and I'm in the car I'm gonna go pick up my hermana from la escuela 
and for you guys already know i'm on my second one and for some reason you know you guys i told you the story my mom's phone picked her name to be avery her name for starbucks so that's why it says avery her name's definitely not avery it's a it's a very much it's very much so a very spanish name i'm not gonna say my mom's name though because she probably wouldn't want me to say that but anyways let's go driving ladies and uh and people who are not ladies i just like saying that anyways let's drive <sighs> shall we So I have made it to my sister's uh, school area and uh, it's like, yeah, two minutes until she gets out. So I'm just chilling here. Man, this is literally the best drink Starbucks has ever dropped. I know I keep saying that, but like, I'm honest. I'm being completely honest. And yeah, I just think that they shouldn't rob us of this and if they want more money they should keep it because i am willing to spend that money for this drink so if you ask me it's like a win-win situation because starbucks you'll get my money as long as you keep this drink and i'll be happy as long as i keep drinking this drink you know so it's a win-win yeah But that's just the way that I see it, you know. I'm just a businesswoman. <laughs> I'm just a businesswoman making business moves, making money moves. So, yeah. Okay, she'll be out in a minute. <sighs> Exciting times. It's, you know what? It's been a good day. It has been a good day. Not much has necessarily happened, but it has been a good day. It's been a good day. And... A calm day which I do need I did need yeah so good I walked out the car and I dropped my my whole bag on the floor like that wasn't funny it wasn't smooth and the kids are coming out officially heading to Universal Studios be there in like 20 ish minutes that's like roughly the drive up the hill, the Hollywood Hills. Heading straight for Super Nintendo World. August 25th so I want to recap what has happened what did happen so we went to Universal and I'm including obviously these clips and we went to the Toadstool Cafe and let me tell you that place sucks like it just sucks we went because we had had Toadstool before 
and everybody's raving about Toad School, and they're like, wow, this place is amazing, this place is so good, it's awesome. And then when we went the first time, it was so garbage. Like, it's the most basic food, and I can make that myself. My mom, she was like, lo podemos hacer aquí en la casa. ¿Por qué vamos a salir para esto? You know what I mean? Like, why are we going to leave the house to go get something that we can make here in the house? And pay like three times the price for it. It doesn't make sense. So when I booked the reservation yesterday, we were pretty excited because we were like, maybe it's because we went super late. Our reservation was 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 for maybe I think eight o'clock, eight p.m. So we went in and then we had to wait. So we didn't really get our food until like nine p.m. So it was late. So we were like, okay, maybe it was due to the fact that like it was late at night, right? So we went in. 5.45 was the reservation and we got our food around like 6.10, 6.20. The most basic and also not very good. I was so disappointed. Like, I kid you not, it was basic and trash yet again. And they we barely got any food because they ran out of everything that we were gonna try. How do you not have spaghetti? They were they ran out of spaghetti, so we couldn't get the kids' meal spaghetti or the adult size spaghetti. They ran out of the garlic knots, so they had no bread. And I was like, how do you not have this stuff? So it was a bad dinner. I mean, we all like reconnected and like it was good like that, but um trash, trash. So after that, um, I told my mom, I was like, mom, I'm sad. Like, I expected better and this place let me down again. And like, I'm just sad, it's my birthday. I, I wanted maybe, I don't know, more. So we went to the downtown area and we were like, okay, let's get you an ice cream cake. We went there. They didn't have the flavors that I wanted. They did have little ice cream cakes, but for me personally, the flavors were just like a no. So I was like, it's fine. I'll just get ice cream. So I got that and I got the churro ice cream. So I got that delicious. Then we came back home and I thought the night was over. And then I was surprised with presents and i thought nobody had bought me anything and i was like it's fine you know i was just glad to go out and just be surrounded by people you know and have my starbucks i was like that's that was good enough for me and have ice cream like that was a good enough day for me um but then i was surprised with presents so first um also i really love how we look today again what do you think, Grogu? I think it's pretty nice, right? Like our hair looks good, our outfit looks good. Yeah. So first I want to show you, man, you guys probably already know what it is, but I actually got this like two weeks ago or three weeks ago or something like that. It was when we went to Disneyland, but not the last time when there was a hurricane. Um. Ta-da! I have literally been begging in my head. I was like, please, 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 I need this. So let me cover this light because this light right here is like really getting in the way. So it's a California Adventure Starbucks cup. Uh, maybe you guys, there you go, yeah. So it's California Adventure. And as you guys know, California Adventure is my favorite theme park of all time. And it is so underrated, so disrespected all the time. And I'm always saying whenever they release something for California Adventure, I need to get my hands on it because the merch is rare AF. It's, it's so rare. Like you always see Disneyland, you never see California Adventure. So I saw this and 
I was gonna buy it for myself anyways, but then I saw it and I was like, mom, you wanna get me an early birthday present? And she was like, okay. Do you need another cup though? And I was like, do you not see what this is? I need it. It's not a want, it's a need. So uh, I have not used it yet, but I think today might be the day that I use it for the first time. So here's my California Adventure cup. So this one I've had for a little while. Let's not, let's put you back over here for right now. And then I was surprised with the bag. A Disney bag like this, you know, the Disney store. And I heard jingles coming from inside like this. I don't know if you guys can hear it. But when I heard that, I already knew for a fact, I knew one thing that I was getting. I didn't know what it was, but I knew, well, I didn't know what design it would be. But I knew it. This sound. That sound. Okay, so there's two things in here. So let me show you the first one. So the first one's a pin. It's a maxi as the power line and Roxanne. So I love the Goofy movie. I love the, love the Goofy movie. So my mom... She was amazing and she got me this pin of Maxi and Roxanne. And I was like, that's amazing. And then obviously we have the power line. And he's a really tiny, there you go. Maybe you can see him. He's back there. He's back there. Um, but I love it. It's amazing. I don't really, I love pins, but I don't really collect pins. Um, I, don't, I actually do collect pins, but like, what am I gonna do? What, where am I gonna put it? Like, I wanna put it on me or something, but there's no reason to do that. But I love it. That was the pin. And the jingle. When I heard the jingle, I already knew what I was going to be getting, but I didn't know the design. Are you ready, everybody? Are you ready? Uh, welcome, my fourth lounge fly and guys I had a whole I need to tell you a story I had a whole meltdown not a meltdown but like I my eyes were closed and everything during the whole process of like getting gifts only these two this one and the pin that was all I got um but when I reached in and I felt it I already knew what it was I knew the exact backpack and everything that this was, and I knew it was this one. So if you, I don't know if you guys can see it, it perfectly. The lighting is a bit eh, but it's a rose gold sequin lounge fly, and they've had this one forever. This is like a staple at this point of the Disney of Disneyland, and I had want I've wanted this backpack since I was like ten. I'm 21 now. That's weird to say. I'm 21. I'm 21. <laughs> um, I've wanted this backpack since I was like 10. And I remember always being told, no, you can't have it. No, no lo puedes tener esto. No, no, no. Like, why is it so expensive? All of this, all of that. And I was always told, just no, you can't have it. And I think, when we went to Disney this past weekend, um, we were in Bing Bongs. And then I came across the backpack and I was looking at it because I love it. I love this backpack. I've wanted it for 11 years. Um, I think this was one of the first lounge flies. It was definitely like, I think in my opinion, like the first one to ever hit the parks. Um, and it's just been kept because it's a staple. But I was looking at it and my mom... Me preguntó, ella me dijo, do you want it? You still need a birthday present. And I said, oh, not today. We can do it later. And I kept doing that the whole time we were there. I saw many things that I wish I had gotten because now I know how short our time was there. But um, she she asked me, do you want it? And I, she knows. I remember I told her in there, I said, no, it's okay. We'll just keep looking around. Maybe we'll get it later. And then I told my sister, because my sister was not alive. <laughs> she hadn't been born 
But I remember I was like, oh yeah, I've wanted this backpack since I was little, since it first came out. I remember, I always begged for this backpack and I never got it. And then when I saw it in the bag, or I felt it and everything, I just started crying. And I know you're probably like, why? But like, it just, it meant a lot to me. It means a lot to me to have it now. And it, it means a lot to know that like my mom, my ma, like she paid it like she always paid it pays attention like she paid attention to me and she was like actually i don't know how to i don't know how to put what i'm feeling into words but it meant a lot because i know that my ma was there and like she, it, it i don't know how to explain it you know i don't know how to explain it but it just, it meant a lot. And I was crying last, like for a, for a while last night when they gave me this and I was, it was just, this is like, <laughs> I don't know what else to say, but um, the, what I had wanted for like 11 years is now here and it's mine. And um, yeah. So that's actually it. That's going to wrap it up for us. Thank you guys for joining me. Um, I'm 21 now. And before I go, I do want to play you guys something. Um, so give me a second, everybody. I'll be right back. I'm 21. Fuck you. Thank you, Aiden. We love that. I love that sound bite. The I'm 21. F you. I love it. I love it. I love it. And I am literally 21. I've been waiting to turn 21 so I can put that in a video and use it. I'm 21 now. So I want to thank you guys for joining me for my 21st birthday vlog. I've had a really surprisingly, I thought, I thought it was going to be a bad birthday. It actually ended up being a really great birthday. Um, so thank you guys for joining me. I'm really uh, happy and hopefully my 21st year is a magical, amazing year where lots of good things happen. So with that being said, I want to thank you guys all for joining me. Muchas gracias. Thank you guys for being here with me. Uh, I'm 21 now, so... F you. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you guys for joining me. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. And until the next video, adios and adios.